hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and in today's video i'm going to be styling my hair so today i did this braided ponytail this is how it's looking really simple really easy and my hair is all sleek i went with the middle part and i love how it turned out it's so easy and simple so if you guys want to see how i did this hairstyle then keep on watching so i'm just gonna go ahead and start doing my ponytail so i want it to be low but not too low so it's going to sit somewhere here so i'm going to section the back And I'm using this styling gel and this one is by ISO Plus. I just found it at my local uh, beauty supply store and I decided to try it out. And it's actually really, really good and really, really affordable. Like this amount, not a lot, just to get it on the roots on around the perimeter of my little ponytail. And I'm also going to be using a lot of rubber bands so I'm just taking one to secure this in place and this is how it's looking so far so now I'm gonna go ahead and create my part because I want a middle part so my part is gonna be here so now I'm gonna continue slicking everything towards the little ponytail that I already have here in the back And now taking my little edge brush i'm going to do some edges but i'm not gonna i don't want to do a lot <laughs> like what i've been doing in my previous videos i just want this to be smooth So that's my hair all sleeked. I'm just gonna turn and show you guys the back. This is how it's looking. So now I'm going to tie down my hair and I'm using my silk scarf and I'm going to wait until my hair is dry and then I'll come back and we can do the ponytail. And while I'm waiting for my hair to get dry, I'm going to be stretching my braiding hair. This is the Darling Yaki braid. So this is what I'm going to use for my ponytail. So I'm going to do this a little bit different this time than I normally do. As you can see, my little ponytail is not long enough. Like if I go ahead and attach the braiding hair, like a full packet of braiding hair is just going to fall off. So I'm going to take my large hook and a small amount of braiding hair. 
and I'm going to hook this through and just pull it through my little ponytail here like so and then now I'm going to form a braid with my hair and the braiding hair so this is just gonna provide like extra security And this is strong enough this is how the braiding hair is looking I've already um, stretched them so now I'm gonna take another smaller like a quarter amount of braiding hair and I'm going to make another braid on top of this one just so that it can like keep getting thicker so Now I'm going to take the rest of the braiding hair and a hair tie and I'm going to tie this on to my hair. So now that it's secured, I'm going to separate another small amount of the braiding hair. This is what I'm going to use to wrap around. And then now with everything that's left, I'm going to form three equal braids. And I'm just going to go ahead and braid my ponytail. So I'm done reading my ponytail and this is how it's looking. So now I'm going to take this extra piece of hair and wrap it around. And now I'm gonna take my blasting spray and spray it around the wrapping piece here just so that it can get stuck and stay smooth and everything can stay like secured. And this is how my ponytail is looking. All done. It doesn't feel heavy at all and it does feel secured especially if you have short hair like me you want it to be secured you don't want to drop it, it does feel secured I didn't even use any like bobby pins or anything like that this is how it's looking and this is 
the length of my ponytail it goes to like um, my waist but I am short so if you want it to be longer maybe you can use expression braiding hair or you can actually fit in some extra braiding hair onto your ponytail to make it longer but I'm happy with how mine turned out and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you guys on the next one bye